upstairs loft. <laughs> that kind of changed. So what happened with the room? So two closets that were gonna be in the master bedroom got removed and they actually took the back half of what was the kitchen pantry to add a walk-in closet, which I think is great yeah. and actually gives more yeah. space in the room. It's very good. But it also kind of changed <laughs> what we're doing. So we didn't, before the TV was nestled in between these two closets and now we need a piece under the TV and I don't think we have enough room to do a bench at the end of the bed, so we're gonna do a chair in the corner instead, yeah. which I think will be nice. Yeah, and just a nice accent chair, maybe with a little bit of color, I think will be good too. And um, we're using the bed, which will be an upholstered headboard yes. with um, um, really tufting and pewter color nail heads, so just really pretty. Yeah. Has a little bit of sparkle in that, just a little bit of yeah. nice flair to that. So we'll I pick up Betty. The kit would be really cute in that corner. Oh, that would be, be a pretty. nice size chair, too. Yeah, it would be. Here's some bedding options. This is actually a new line that we are carrying, Eastern Accents. Um, everything is made in Chicago, which is so cool. I didn't realize um, it was made in Chicago. Yeah, everything. They don't outsource it or nothing That's awesome. like that. So um, some beautiful options here. Are you thinking about a color? I know everything is kind of warm. I know, and I kind of want something soft, but I would like to pull in some color, I think. Yeah, I was thinking, and I don't know, maybe uh, we have a little bit of navy going mm -hmm. on. Um, and I know our homeowner really likes navy too, but um, obviously the homeorama. We don't yeah. really have much room for artwork in there, do we? Actually, there's we gonna be some, some wall, probably mm, along the wall. Yeah. Yeah, what I would like to do, some artwork. Um, along the wall, so the bed will be here, and the TV's here, mm -hmm. and then the kit would be here, mm -hmm. and then this is a pretty decent size wall that leads to that new walk-in closet. Yeah. So I think there would be a I place think that would be good. good. Probably just one and done. Are you thinking with that piece underneath the TV that needs to have storage, or I think it would be nice. Because if you've got somebody staying over, I mean, I know they're going to have the closet, but... Is this the guest bedroom or the master bedroom? This is the guest, guest bedroom. Oh. Yeah. I thought I heard you say master, so I was just double checking before. Um, yeah, this is the guest bedroom. And it's actually right when you come in the back, it's right there. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So, there were the closets here. And this door wasn't here at all. Right. But this wall is still pretty long to yes. put some art on. And I put the chair here and yep. then probably a 65 to 72 inch something yes. there. Mm -hmm. um, that would be really pretty. Mm -hmm. That Casabella that I have in here with the mercury glass front. Oh. Wouldn't Ooh. that be beautiful with this? That would be fun. Yes, uh -huh. I like that. Yeah, and that would make it look that pewter color in the nail heads and just the yes. reflection that would make that room look really yeah. nice. That would be pretty. That would be gorgeous with this. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I like that. It weighs a boatload. It does. <laughs> That's why we don't have to move it. Right. <laughs> so now getting some bedding that would yeah. kind well, of pull that all together. And that will go well with the nightstands too. Because they're those You want to do the same nightstands? Yeah. I think okay. so. Okay. I think so. Okay. I don't have those. The Theron? The Theron. The Theron. Okay. Mm -hmm. Kind of a darker wood mm -hmm. that I feel like would play off the darker wood on the surround oh, yeah. of that. I think yeah. that would be pretty. I think that would be really nice. And mm -hmm. those would be great to pull back in here to the store because they're just really... Well, you could, they go I mean, in a you could use them for dip. Right. Mm -hmm. Right. Maybe picking out what artwork we think would be pretty and then mm. going off of that. Mm -hmm. That would be easier. It's fun. Look at that. Oh, that's really pretty. Isn't that gorgeous? Well, look at the. Oh, 
It's not necessarily the citron, but the gray, the, the teal. I yeah, like it's that it's how muted it is. It's so pretty. And even this, bringing this in could yeah. be gorgeous. Which is kind of the color of the, the yeah. uh, case good yeah. the sideboard. Maybe that could be the lumbar piece front. at the end or yeah. something. Yeah, or I the lumbar that. I just too. Isn't that beautiful? Honestly, I wouldn't mind bringing just a little bit of the citron color. I know, I think it. that's it's really fun. Color. Yeah. These right here, this palette. Mm -hmm. I don't like this one. But this palette is stunning. I don't mm. love these two together. But it could be a little bit it of could a, be, yeah. uh, away from them. Mm -hmm. The backdrop there. But I love it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Really cute. Really what is it showing as the duvet cover? But. Is it? Oh, look, but it's edged in this. Perfect. With the buttons. I think, oh, I think that's beautiful. Yeah, I think it is too. Okay. Those are pretty, but I'm not sure this is big enough. Yeah. 62 square. And I think maybe more rectangle would be better. I think space. so. Well, and I don't, yeah, I agree. Oh, we have that set of three. I actually was looking at these. With the white background. Cause look, oh, just that a carries smidge everything. of that, that kind of purpley. Oh, that's really pretty. Thirty-one by forty-nine each. So that would get us to our size. Yeah. That's like a. Oh. I've seen those. That I've been. Oh, I've looked at those a few times. They are. Okay. Gorgeous. And those, uh, what's that called again? Pandora's okay. Forest. Okay, that is a new one to us. Mm-hmm. And they're okay. each 31 by 49. That would be, be really fun. Stairs locked. <laughs> that kind of changed. We kind of, yeah, I had to flip it. Yeah. So. The TV is on the big wall. Because originally, this doorway was over here. Mm -hmm. And we had this whole space, and that was going to be the TV. Right. And then when we went in, this doorway was completely different, and you could actually see that it was wired over here for the TV. Oh, it was wired when you were there? When yeah. I was there, it wasn't, uh -huh. so it was a guess. Yeah. However, since we did the modular sectional, mm -hmm. <laughs> thank you. I know. <laughs> um, That's good. Essentially, I just flipped it, and I was. I'm torn about, right now I have it this way, but we could also, I was torn about whether I wanted mm -hmm. to walk into the back of it here, or if I want the back mm -hmm. of it, I don't know, I'm almost you know, leaning we could do. now we towards have the uh, back, you know, when you put that ottoman in to mm -hmm. kind of open it up over here, I like this better, because I think okay. just coming upstairs, I don't know, there's so many windows, it's not going to look closed in, which is great, Right. but... Um, I know it's either gonna you're either gonna watch it walk into it here, which this is a nice wide it open is. space. Really because then I'm thinking, okay, if the, the bars, I don't know. I, it, so we could flip it, and the L could go this yeah. way, and this chair could be here. Yeah. We could do and it that could either be done way. At the last minute too, once we, you know, we yeah, go, we could yeah. do that pretty easy once we see how it all looks. Right. Yeah. So this got mixed because I had that. I mean, I guess we could still scoot it up and do that. It's a big piece. It is a big piece. Um, however, what we were thinking for along the wall under the TV is going to have ooh, it's going to have to be a much bigger piece. Even bigger than this. What I have in here is a 90 inch because that wall is 15 feet, and we put something that's 70 inches in there, and it's going to look dinky. Yeah. Yeah. And we can't really add like tall bases or anything like that because it's the TV. I mean, the only other it. thing I thought is if we did like a credenza and a couple cool bookcases mm -hmm. on either side. I mean, this is built in back here, but there aren't right. built ins in the house at all. No, I and I just thought, you know, if they wanted to do, they could do cute bins with toys for the grandkids mm -hmm. or books. Yes. You would want the bookcases to be too. I don't know. 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 I don
know. Um, so this is definitely out for crafting. Unless we are putting something on either side of it. I mean, think about... That. You're essentially looking that at a room. wall probably the size of these two bays to here with a piece about that big in the middle. It's going to look... And how big is the TV? Could you tell? I know. Mm -hmm. We need to plan for as big as possible. So after visiting the house and realizing that there were some changes made structurally, those changes definitely affect then how the furniture goes in the room. Now what we're doing when you come up the stairs the large wall to the right is where the TV is going to be. So exactly opposite of where it was before. On that large wall, we're going to do, they're having a big TV for the kids and we're going to put a large console underneath the TV on that wall. Our sectional will now still be an L shape, but will now be facing that wall rather than the other wall. The chair, we've got an awesome kind of round barrel chair, great for kids and cozy, that will be catty corner to the sectional, but also able to space that TV wall now. To allow plenty of room behind the sectional, we nixed a console table that was gonna be there. And actually, I kind of like how this creates a cozy space. 